Hello dolly lovers and welcome back to my channel. I thought today would be the day that I do my nursery update so you guys can see how it has come along officially. So this is the door to my room and let's go in and get started. So here is what I am working with so far. I won't be showing the inside of the closet as of yet, but this is a door we just walked through and right next to it to the left is the closet. So once that is all straightened out, there will be a closet tour later on down the line. But for the most part, this side of the room where the window is is going to be my designated nursery setting and i have changed it around a couple of times if you guys are following me on instagram you have been able to see everything i do every step of the way from the painting of the walls to what you guys see here so i'll just start from the left and move over to the right down here we have little miss tabitha mayling and she's just seated on her little plushy elephant seat and she's just chilling there waiting 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 for mommy to play with her <laughs> then i have my changing table and I purchased this changing table from Once Upon a Child and I was so happy to find it for a super good price. Pretty much half the price that I planned on paying for it. And we had some leftover paint from painting one of our other spare bedrooms. So I decided to paint it from espresso to white to match the rest of the nursery. And down here I just came across this really cute bath rug that says I woke up this way and it has like gold tinsel pieces and it's a really pretty pink and I didn't really have a theme for the nursery but I knew that I wanted the color scheme to be really fresh and clean and pink and white so that is what we're working with right now um some of these pieces just kind of found me and they don't exactly fit but I think to get me started, they're a good fit for right now. So on the changing table, I just have um, these two baskets. The one that I keep hair accessories in, and the other are the toddler shoes. And as you can see, that basket got really full really quick because I have some more shoes at the very bottom. All of those clothes stacked up are Tuesday Elizabeth's clothes. And I will be putting together my chest of drawers. Hopefully this week it will come in the mail. Um, so a lot of the stuff that you see under here is probably going to go in the drawers. So I won't have that to worry about for too much longer. I also have um, this packaging for uh, Bitsters, which is... The company that I work for designs this product and we design the packaging and I got the opportunity to redo this entire packaging so I'm pretty proud of it. The only catch is that this product in particular is made for Costco Japan so it won't be anywhere in the US I believe as of yet with the new design but if you are out there in Japan and you happen to see it then you know who designed it <laughs> so I'm super proud of that I just have this little mock-up box here because it's a baby item and I think it fits really nicely in the nursery on the changing table so who we have on the changing table right now is Tuesday Elizabeth. She came with me earlier this week for a little photo shoot and she's still wearing her little white onesie from the photo shoot so I have to pick out an outfit for her to change her clothes and she just has her stuffed animals all about her. This teddy was from my reborn daddy as one of my very first Valentine's Day gifts so thanks hun <laughs> I kept on to it uh, for all this time um, so here 
we have my white curtains, which I am so happy about that I finally found some white curtains that aren't too see-through. And in the middle, we just have this mermaid basket with toys and blankets in there and just some stuff I threw on top that I need to get a little bit more organized. She has her little bunny chest that um, Topanga is sitting on right now, which has all the toddlers' night clothes in there, nighties, and um, like pajamas and slippers are all in there. Topanga's just sitting there with her big, beautiful gray eyes, just sitting there under the window. And right here is this little play mat that I got um, through it, but I haven't set it up just yet. And I think it would be a cute little addition for doing videos. So over further here we have the crib. Now if you guys have seen some of my posts on Instagram, you knew that I had like all the toddlers in the crib and I had uh, Trevor on the changing table and then Trudy was on the floor on her boppy. Well, I moved that around because as you can see, we are um, minus one. Taya is no longer with us. <laughs> she has moved on to a new reborn mommy and you guys can check her out on Billy's Nursery. Her name is still Taya and she also has a really cute twin sister named Star. So you guys won't be seeing her around my nursery any longer. I do have plans for 2019 and um, some uh, one, at least one baby had to go to make room. So I'm happy about the decision. Her new mommy is in love with her. So yes, that's why you do not see Taya anywhere in here. So anyway, this is the crib, the mini crib I purchased <clears throat> from Amazon. And I won't go into too much detail because I do plan on doing a review on this crib and on the changing table as well. Um, just for you guys out there who may be interested in putting together your own nursery, especially if you have limited space, you want the details, you want measurements, what colors it comes in, and all of that, all that good stuff, because that's the stuff that I was looking for when I was putting together this room. So that will be on a separate video, but I did want to show you guys the mini crib, and this is the bedding that I um, did a haul on a few months ago of the stuff that I won on auction and here it is all put together in the mini crib now this bedding is actually for a full size crib but you know I had to make it work y'all I had to make it work and um I think it came out really cute I just tucked things here and there to make it fit and I think it came out really nice so here are my babies oh my god y'all like this room is a dream come true right now and I'm just in heaven I'm just in heaven right now and I'm just so proud of this room even though it's not 100% complete it's just the fact that I did it myself from scratch like I painted the walls I did the work I was in here and I'm so proud of this room but here's my little TJ oh my god I could just pick him up and snuggle him right now he's so so cute he has his bear and his little blue nautica blanket and here is Trudy. She's so cute. Look at her. She looks right at home. And this is one of those um, new, uh, what's that brand called at Walmart? That new brand, Wonder Nation. She has one, of, I think this is what it is. Wonder Nation, or is it Gerber? Ah, I think it might be Gerber. I'm not sure. But, um, yeah. She has her little new outfit on. She looks so cute. And up here, we do have the little musical mobile. I don't plan on using this too often. Because usually I'm talking in the videos. Or I have, um, uh, music playing over it. But it does work. So that's what it sounds like. Oh, it's so cute. I love everything. And that's pretty much 
my nursery, you guys. The light is getting bright and the sun is starting to come out, so it's getting bright in here, which I'm kind of glad about. It's my nursery so far. So that is my nursery so far, you guys. This is the opposite side of the room, and um, I don't know if I said it here, but um, I do plan on having a very large vanity set up right here, which is why I left this side of the room completely clear. So I wouldn't uh, overbear it and then, you know, end up running out of space. So I left this side of the room completely clear. This is going to be like my beauty studio portion of the room. Because I do love fashion and makeup. And I definitely, definitely need my own spot to do makeup and stuff. And use my computer and stuff. So this is where that is going to be happening. I plan on having like... Some kind of seating arrangement for the vanity, big Hollywood light mirror, all of that. I really hope it comes together the way I want, but that's what this side of the room is going to be about. And as far as this far wall, I'm not exactly sure yet. Once I get the vanity in, I'll be able to see what kind of room I have to play with and what I'm going to do with this side of the room so yeah that is pretty much it you guys i'm literally smiling ear to ear as i do this video because <laughs> i'm so happy about it and the light is just perfect right now and i'm just really proud of it and i hope you guys love it I